Hello everyone, I'm Mallory. I'm here with All About Cats and today we're going to be bringing you our top 11 recommendations for the best wet cat food you can buy. So over the last year we've spent a lot of time thinking about and researching cat food. We've reviewed over 80 different cat food brands and hundreds of different formulas. We've stayed on top of the latest in the industry by attending industry events, talking to experts and insiders, and spent a lot of time staying on top of the latest in feline nutrition as well. So based on all of that experience and the knowledge gained through it, these are our top recommendations for the best wet food you can give your cat. Our number one recommendation is this food from New Zealand brand Feline Natural. So what sets this food apart from the competition is its diverse array of species appropriate whole prey inspired muscle meat, organs, and yes, blood. This food is made with chicken, chicken heart, and a variety of venison organs along with blood. So it is a really prey inspired diet that honors your cat's needs as a carnivore. The food also contains New Zealand green lip mussels, which are an outstanding source of omega-3 fatty acids for skin and coat health, as well as anti-inflammatory effects. According to the guaranteed analysis, this food is approximately 59.4% protein, 39.9% fat, and 0.7% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. So overall, it has a great macronutrient distribution and seems to truly honor your cat's needs as a carnivore. My cats were not huge fans of this food. They ate it, but quite reluctantly, I would say that it was their least favorite of the 11 foods we tested. However, I've seen a lot of reviews from customers who say that their cats did enjoy this food, so it should be worth a try. This food is the most expensive one on this list at roughly $6.57 per day if you're feeding a typical 10 pound cat. So it's pretty pricey, but given the apparent ingredient quality and outstanding macronutrient distribution, it could be worth it. Our runner-up is Hound and Gatos. Their foods are very straightforward and very simple. For example, this chicken and chicken liver recipe contains chicken, chicken liver, salmon oil, agar as a thickener, and a variety of synthetic vitamins, minerals, and amino acids to make the food nutritionally complete. It's a very straightforward recipe and it's a good option for cats with food sensitivities or allergies or intolerances or even issues like IBD. Based on the guaranteed analysis, this food is 52.5% protein and 47.5% fat on a dry matter basis. In our taste test, Hound and Gatos didn't fare extremely well. My cats didn't seem to be big fans of it. They tried Hound and Gatos in the past and it can be a hit or miss. Sometimes they'll eat it and sometimes they won't. Our third recommendation is a bit different from the other foods on this lineup. It's Nam Nam Mao's Chicken Chow Meow. So this is a homemade style fresh food that looks and tastes a lot like chicken salad without any mayonnaise or other creamy additives. Nom Nom Now foods are not sold in traditional stores. Instead, Nom Nom Now offers something of a cat food meal delivery service. So you'll subscribe to Nom Nom Now and then receive the food on a weekly, bi-weekly, or monthly basis. Each portion is measured out for your cat's dietary needs. So you'll never have to worry that you're feeding your cat too much or too little based on his weight goals. Nom Nom Now foods are human grade products, so they're made from restaurant quality ingredients in a human food processing facility. This promises a somewhat higher level of ingredient quality than you would find in feed grade food. So this chicken recipe is roughly, according to the guarantee analysis, 78.3% protein, 17.4% fat, and 18.2% carbohydrates. It's much higher in carbohydrates than we would prefer, but given its outstanding ingredient quality and excellent palatability, this food might be a good option. In our taste test, my cats absolutely love Nom Nom Now. This isn't the first time they've eaten it, and every time that they have it, they scarf it down. I think that it's very similar to the table scraps that, in particular, Wessie absolutely loves. So I think that it really taps into their love of this kind of fresh, chunky, rippable, shreddable food. So because Nom Nom Now follows that subscription meal delivery service model, 
your daily feeding costs are going to vary depending on which subscription plan you choose and how many cats you have and other factors. Generally, that price ranges from two to six dollars per day. Our fourth recommendation is this turkey entree from Pure Vita. Now, this food is a particularly good option if your cat has any food sensitivities or allergies. All Pure Vita foods are made with food sensitivities in mind. The food is extremely straightforward. It contains just turkey meat, turkey liver, turkey broth, agar agar as a thickener, and an array of synthetic additives that make the food nutritionally complete and balanced. According to the guaranteed analysis, this food is 53.4% protein, 41.2% fat, and 5.4% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. So it has a great species appropriate macronutrient distribution. Pure Vita did well in our cat food taste test. My cat seemed to enjoy eating this pate. This Pure Vita food costs an estimated $4.38 per day if you're feeding a typical 10 pound cat. All of the other foods up until this point have been either pâtés or, in the case of Nom Nom now, a fresh homemade style food. But if your cat prefers shreds and gravy, Maruva has a lot of great options for you. Their chicken fricassee recipe is pretty straightforward. It features shredded chicken set in a thickened broth with some sunflower seed oil and fish oil as a source of omega-3 fatty acids. According to our estimations, based on the guarantee analysis, this food is 72.5% protein, 18.1% fat, and 9.4% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. In our cat food taste test, both of my cats, Wessie and Forrest, seem to love the food's taste and texture. According to our estimations, this food is going to cost about $3 per day. So this food from Nulo's Freestyle line, their turkey and chicken recipe, seems to have a great reputation among cats with constipation. Now, this food contains a little bit of pumpkin, which is a very familiar home remedy for cats with constipation and diarrhea. It also contains guar gum, which is a source of fiber that could also help to relieve this type of digestive issues. While a lot of the other foods in our lineup are single protein or limited ingredient foods, this food contains a few different protein sources. It contains chicken, turkey, and tuna. This food is 56.4% protein, 33.3% fat, and 10.3% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. When my cat Wessie tried out the Nulo Freestyle Turkey and Chicken recipe, he absolutely loved its soft, creamy consistency. It was a really big hit. According to our estimates, this food is going to cost close to $2.55 per day if you're feeding a 10-pound cat. Our next recommendation is going to be a particularly good choice for cats who need to lose weight. It's Tiki Cat. So you're going to find a lot of great recipes from Tiki Cat. They're all pretty similar. They contain shredded chicken and fish in broth. Their foods have plenty of protein and not a lot of fat. They tend to be quite low carbohydrate and low in calories. All qualities that make them a good option for cats who need to lose weight. In particular, we recommend their Puka Puka Luau Succulent Chicken and Chicken Consomme recipe. This recipe is extremely straightforward. It contains just chicken meat shredded and set in broth with sunflower seed oil as a source of fat. According to our estimates, this food is 86.5% protein and 13.5% fat on a dry matter basis. So it's a very low fat food with plenty of protein and zero carbohydrate content. Both of my cats, Wessie and Forrest, seem to enjoy the shredded consistency of the Tiki Cat food and ate it with vigor. At roughly $4.86 per day, if you're feeding a typical 10 pound cat, this food is definitely on the expensive side. Next up is our top recommendation for picky cats. It's the real chicken pate recipe from Instinct by Nature's Variety. Like so many other cats in customer reviews, my cats seem to really enjoy the food's soft, kind of chunky, lumpy pate consistency and gobbled it right up. The food features chicken, turkey, and eggs as its primary protein sources, and overall it's a protein-rich food without a lot of the carbohydrate content that we want to avoid. The food is roughly 56.8% protein, 
40.5% fat, and 2.7% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. This food from Instinct by Nature's Variety is a little bit cheaper than most of the other ones on this list at about $2.28 per day. So far, all of the foods on this list have been pretty expensive. If you want a food that's a bit more affordable, I would recommend checking out Petco's Wholehearted line. They have a lot of really low carbohydrate, pretty species appropriate foods that don't contain any of the byproducts and artificial colors that you're going to find in so many other budget level foods. Today, we're recommending their chicken recipe flaked in gravy. And this food offers quality and ingredients similar to those found in like this Boruba recipe for a fraction of the price. So this food is going to cost about $1.50 a day if you're feeding a 10 pound cat. And it's made from chicken in broth with some xanthan gum, a little bit of tapioca starch, and tuna oil as a source of omega-3 fatty acids. It's not perfect, but its macronutrient distribution is pretty good. So according to our calculations, this food is roughly 71.4% protein, 15.4% fat, and 7% carbohydrates. My cats seem to really enjoy it. They ate it right up. So our next recommendation is going to be a particularly good option if you have kittens. So it's Wellness Core's turkey and chicken recipe for kittens. It's a pate style food that features chicken and turkey and some herring as its primary protein sources. And it has all of the qualities that your kitten needs um, to support those early growth stages. So it's rich in DHA for brain and eye development. It has plenty of protein and it's relatively calorie dense. The food seems to have a great taste that cats really like. Um, even though my cats aren't kittens, they seem to enjoy the food. It did have a slightly firmer texture than I was expecting, uh, but you could fix that by mixing in some warm water to soften it up. So according to our calculations, the food is about 57% protein, 35.7% fat, and 7% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. This food is one of the more affordable that you can buy. It's going to cost around $1.14 per day. So it's a pretty economical option for feeding a kitten. And finally, uh, our last recommendation is for cats on the opposite end of the age spectrum. It's our top pick for seniors. So the food emphasizes turkey, turkey liver, and dried egg products as its main sources of protein, which are all easy for your cat to digest uh, as his protein requirements increase as he enters his senior years. The food also contains both salmon oil and New Zealand green mussels, which are both great sources of the omega-3 fatty acids that can help to relieve inflammation associated with arthritis and other inflammatory issues that your cat might deal with as he goes through his senior years. Now, the biggest drawback of this food for senior cats is the fact that it isn't going to work very well with other common conditions faced by seniors. So if your cat has hyperthyroidism, for example, this might not be a good option due to the inclusion of agar, which is quite high in iodine and might be a problem for hyperthyroid cats. And it might also not be a good choice if your cat has kidney disease. That said, if your cat is in generally good health, this protein rich recipe from Dr. Elsie's Clean Protein could be a really good option. This food is about 49% protein, 40% fat, and 10% carbohydrates on a dry matter basis. In our taste test, this food did not fare particularly well. They ate it eventually, but it was quite reluctantly, and they didn't eat much of it. However, I have read customer reviews from people saying that their cats really enjoy this food, so it should be worth a try. The food costs roughly $2.24 per day if you're feeding a typical 10 pound cat. So that's it. We've covered all 11 of our recommendations for the best wet cat food that you can buy. I hope that this was able to help you. I know that choosing the right cat food is a complex process. There are so many factors to consider, but I hope that this video and our recommendations have helped you to get a better sense of what's available and what qualities to look for in a great food. If you would like to learn more about any of the products mentioned here, check out the description. We have links to all of them there. 
When you're in the description, you'll also see a link to the full written version of this review. And we go into a lot more depth on each of these products, as well as what we look for in a great wet cat food. All right. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you found it helpful. Take care. Bye.